It was the executive producer of this film, Hal E. Chester, who added those shots of the demon into the finished film, rather than going along with director Jacques Tenure's idea of only suggesting the monster, letting audiences create the monster in their minds. Chester also rewrote some of Charles Bennett's script, which angered Bennett a great deal. And it was Charles Bennett who'd owned the rights to the story for years and had not only co-written the screenplay with Chester, but also had hoped to direct the movie. But when Bennett couldn't get anyone interested in financing the project, Hal Chester offered him a six-month option on the whole project, during which time Chester did get it made. And as the boss, Chester indeed tampered with the script and hired Jacques Tenure, not Charles Bennett, to direct it. Stick around for another horror classic coming right up. This one from 1953, starring Vincent Price as the owner of a wax museum. Tonight on Turner Classic Movies, the scares refuse to wane as Vincent Price constructs a house of wax. Then Craig T. Nelson and Joe Beth Williams host uninvited guests in Poltergeist. And Joan Crawford may always belong in a straitjacket. Hi.